Holly Willoughby was joined by Alison Hammond after explaining her usual co-star Philip Schofield had the week off. During the episode, the pair were joined by guests who were showing off their dog's multicolored fur. However, despite Holly giving a disclaimer that Di was dog-friendly, the RSPCA and viewers of the show were outraged and slammed the segment. Dog owners Vicky Pearman and Holly Britton joined the ITV presenters who showcased their business creative dog grooming championships in 2019. Before talking to the ladies, Holly explained, it's the latest trend taking the dog world by storm as pet owners turn their beloved poodles into beautiful works of art. Making a joke of what people were going to say about the segment, she added, I can almost hear people screaming at their TVs because there will be those that will see those pictures and go this isn't right, this is cruel. It's a natural dye, they get tested beforehand. You've got dogs that don't like it, you don't do it with them. Amazon's three-day sale is now on, top deals on electronics, home and fashion explaining the process of dyeing the dogs, the ladies explained, till we shave it off. We usually do, for the year, the same design and just improve each competition. Then it's a sad day when it all comes off. When Allison asked what happens if they make a mistake, they replied, you just kind of wing it. Their appearance and comments made about winging it sparked concern among viewers and the RSPCA who made a statement to Metro. Co.uk. Dr. Samantha Gaines, from the RSPCA's Companion Animals Department, said, Dogs are living, sentient creatures. Dying or painting them for our entertainment sends out a worrying message and carries no benefits to the animals themselves. Grooming is, without question, an essential part of dog ownership, but these pets should not be treated as novelty accessories. We are worried that subjecting dogs to these types of grooms and parading dogs with novelty hairdos could encourage some owners to forget that these are intelligent, sentient animals and not gimmicks or toys. Don't miss! Great Expectation viewers slam woke and dark BBC adaptation, Insight, Antiques Roadshow guest staggered by value of Captain Cook's spoons, watch, Countryfile viewers blast BBC for pushing edible insect idea, latest, furthermore, it risks encouraging other practices which could be detrimental to dogs too, and sets a worrying precedent for how we treat animals in society. Dogs have their own emotions, preferences and needs. Each is an individual with their own personality. Yet creative grooming like this has the potential to perpetuate the idea that dogs are objects or toys, and ours to objectify or treat as we see fit. Since this segment aired, we've received a number of concern messages from members of the public, reminding us that most dog owners prefer to treat their pets as the intelligent, sentient animals they are viewers of the show were outraged, with user Ophelia expressing, how would they like it if someone colored their hair like those dogs and made them look ridiculous? Just so wrong and cruel hashtag this morning. Flopsy fumed, if you wouldn't do it on a customer's dog why do you think it's okay to do on your own dog? Hashtag this morning. At DJMCG24 commented, Hashtag this morning what those women are doing to those dogs is just cruel. The dogs don't get to choose being groomed like that. It's cruelty. At anti underscore Dana stated, dogs need to be dogs, I don't mind grooming or a little extra but this is ridiculous. This can't help with their interactions with other dogs, as they rely on shapes of their body, fur ears, eyes and tail reactions. 
it would make them harder to read each other hashtag this morning. At Mick John said, the dog art segment was disgusting I hope this gets loads of complaints today. Hashtag this morning. Sick, this morning airs weekdays from 10am on ITV.